Remixing a live loop song using the built-in effects is one of the most addictive and fun things you can do on an iPad, iPhone, or any iOS device. The effects are great. They work really well with the touch interface, and they also work extremely well with your gyroscope. So I've got it on the iPad right now, and what I'll do is tap the effects button here at the top. When I do that, I have two things going up right now. The big main area is a filter on the left side and a repeater on the right side. So I'll play a column and activate the filter by tapping with my finger. If you find an area you like, you can lock it by tapping the lock button. You can unlock it and let it go back again. The repeater's here on the right with adjustable rate. And that's pretty cool. You've got a bit crusher here on a strip. And you've got this chopper right here. Again, all adjustable with the touch strip and a slide. You've got two levels of reverse. Right there as well as some record scratching. Again, two levels, one side each. And two levels of stop. How fast will it stop? But wait, that's not all. Nope, you can customize those effects. If you tap on the filter, you'll be treated to a couple of different things. Wobbles, orbits, delays. So you can set these effects to be whatever you want. I'll change it to orbit. And if you don't want to use your finger, simply tap on the accelerometer button here. And now, and I could do that with the repeater. So you can have quite a lot of fun tilting your device around and activating the different effects that GarageBand has to offer you.